Hello friends, Ben here for Giant Loop, and today I'm here at Cascade Moto Triumph in Beaverton, Oregon, and I want to show you some soft luggage options for this Triumph Scrambler. This is a 1200, and this is a bike that some people think is a little bit notoriously difficult to add luggage to, mostly because of the single-sided exhaust. So today I'm going to show you a few options if you want to get out and do day trips or go moto camping on this bike on a Triumph Scrambler, some stuff that I think might work for you. I'm starting out with just a couple bags here. One, the Giant Loop Zigzag Handlebar Bag. This is the glove box for your motorcycle, fits on any bike, and unsurprisingly, it fits very well right here on the handlebars of the Scrambler. This is an inexpensive bag, plenty of room for your daily essentials, your phone, you got like a power bar, a tool kit, your registration, extra pair of gloves, sunglasses. This is a quick and easy thing that you can add to your bike and it comes off and can be used in a ton of places. So anything with handlebars, you can even run your belt through it and use it as a fanny pack. I always recommend this for just about any bike and it fits perfectly here on the Triumph Scrambler. Now the other bag that I've mounted for you today is our Giant Loop Tillamook Dry Bag. This is a 48 liter bag, 100% waterproof. It opens on both ends and this is probably my favorite favorite piece of luggage that we sell because it is so versatile and can be used in so many ways. I use it a ton in my truck, anytime I'm camping out of my trailer, whatever, but the magic of this bag is that it comes with these four buckles and loops, and all you have to do is find something on the motorcycle that you can loop it around, run the buckle back through, and this thing is basically a top case that can go on pretty much any bike. I had no problem attaching it to this Triumph Scrambler, and this is 48 liters, so I can get my entire moto camping kit, sleeping bag, tent, pillow, air mattress, all of that in this bag. So if you want to go moto camping on your scrambler, it's a great place to start. Let me show you how I've mounted it. So you can see on the front here, and this bag comes with all of these straps, but all I've done is I take the buckle and I just ran it around this little, uh, where the rack comes out of the subframe here, and then back through itself and you just attach it to the bag and you can tighten it down. And on the back, if you can see the scrambler actually has these little slots uh, and into which you can put straps. And so I just ran it to the very rear strap, tighten that down. And that is, that's solid on there. It's not very full. If it was fuller, this would be a little bit more solid, but you get the idea. So if you're looking to go moto camping on a scrambler, uh, I think this Tillamook is a great bag to start with a great centerpiece for your kit. Let me show you a couple other options are smaller dry bags that will also mount up quick and easy more for day trips and stuff like that. Another great option that mounts directly to the rear of the scrambler here. This is the Giant Loop Rogue bag. This is an 18 liter dry bag, opens on both ends, just like the Tillamook I just showed you. And I've just mounted it with one of our giant loop pronghorn straps. This is a 32 inch strap through the loops here and uh, that's not going anywhere. So plenty of room there for your lunch, your tools, your survival kit, your tire changing stuff. Lots and lots of room in that 18 liter bag. Great place to carry your jacket, extra supplies. So big fan of that Rogue. One question we get a lot with the scramblers is will the horseshoe shaped bags work? How does it work with the single sided exhaust? And so I've mounted the Great Basin here as an example. So you can see one way it could work. Great Basin has mounts in three places, one on each side, it's identical, except not on the Scrambler because it's asymmetrical, but this strap right to the passenger foot peg. And as you can see, it just rests right on top of the factory heat shield. It's the same on the other side, except the foot peg with no heat shield. And then here's the important part. If you're worried about exhaust clearance, technically, as long as your bag is not coming in direct contact with the exhaust, you should be fine. All of these bags come with a heat shield, one of our hot springs heat shields, and there's plenty of clearance here for adding one if you wanted to, just for extra peace of mind. This bag is not resting on the pipe. If it was full, it might sit down a little lower, but I think it's very viable to run this horseshoe shaped bag here on a scrambler even, so check that out. And on the back, I've just run the straps and it actually comes with some loops that you can put for a more sort of permanent setup. But just for demonstration purposes, I've just run the beaver tail straps underneath the bar on the back here to pull it back and down. And uh, I feel pretty good about the mounting here on the scrambler. So that's a few options for you scrambler owners out there, specifically for this Triumph Scrambler 1200, but probably many scrambler setups, you could run a similar bag setup as the ones I've showed you today. So you've got some day tripping options, you've got some motorcycle camping options, and you've got this big Great Basin saddlebag as an option. And don't forget, you can add a Tillamook or a Rogue dry bag to the back of this bag very easily without any additional space on the bike. Don't forget that all of our products are backed by our limited lifetime warranty and all orders over $75 from GiantLoopMoto.com ship for free. Consider subscribing to the channel for more bike specific fitment videos, gear videos, and other great content. And don't forget that YouTube subscribers save 10% with promo code subscriber. If you are not sure what setup might work for your bike or your needs, you can always reach out to us. Use that chat now feature on GiantLoopMoto.com or call or email and we'll help you get set up with what works exactly for you because we want to make sure our customers are satisfied. Big shout out and thank you to our friends here at Cascade Moto Triumph in Beaverton. Definitely come check them out. I'll link their website in the description. Thank you for watching. Go light, go fast, go far.
with Giant Loop.